UN Secretary General Ban Ki-moon's words before the UN Committee on the Inalienable Rights of the Palestinian People were firm. Ban issued a bold condemnation of the Israeli settlement activities while describing his meetings with the Security Council. I repeat it from position of the United Nations. The settlements are illegal under international law and threaten to destroy the two-state solution. I urge Israel to take action consistent with the prior agreements. Secretary General Ban Ki-moon's comments at the opening of the 2016 proceedings bemoaned a lack of progress and warned that patience in Gaza and the West Bank could be running out. The people of Palestine have lived through half a century of occupation and they have heard half a century of statements condemning it. But life hasn't meaningfully changed. Palestinian Ambassador Riyad Mansour was appreciative of the Secretary General's words and graciously thanked all countries which are aiding Palestine. Mansour's remarks called for concrete action against Israeli occupation. We believe we can do something. The status quo is unsustainable. We have to double our efforts in order to open doors for peace, and we have to find ways for opening such doors. While many officials urged negotiations toward a two-state solution, Rabbi Yasrul David Weiss told Press TV that many Jews around the world want Israel to be dismantled. Weiss says Israel's existence is a clear violation of Jewish law. Saying that we are allowed to occupy another people because God said so, and that that's the, the, the greatest uh, rebellion against God, uh, it, 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 is, um, it is rooted in blasphemy. It is rooted in heresy against God. As is Israeli settlements continue to expand and Palestinian resistance to Israeli crimes is intensifying. Many world leaders are nervously watching events, hoping to prevent any further escalation. Caleb Maupin, Press TV, New York.